bell didn't it's ring. so loud out there. What is that? That is an Amazon delivery truck oh. that is backing up or something. Oh, okay. We're still here, baby. Hi, welcome. Hey. We're... I want to get this map. That little low-res little lighthouse grave Alexandrian obelisk of a map location. I want to go get it. We're going to go fuck it up. How's that sound? Yeah, let's head over to Agil Lake. Agil. Or as I like to call it, Soda Lake. Okay, sure. From uh, is that what it, is that what like it was? I know there was like Choco Mountain and shit like that. I remember there's Cheese Bridge, <laughs> Choco Mountain. It's delicious. Uh, Pizza Combo Alley. Oh, I definitely want to go there. By the way, in case you couldn't tell by the way we're talking, we're you know what I'm gonna do. I want to make sure none of these are the soldiers with the it's hat. It's Brett, and we're the Beer Bros. Everybody, did you like our new jingle, everybody? Super Beer Bros. Let's play some video games. You're really pushing it. I don't I don't hate it. I think it's fine. I think it's slightly clever in the way that the arrow inside the FedEx is clever, but it's like so clever that like you don't even notice it for like the first 15 years the logo exists. That's the best kind of clever. Like, what is it? What is it? What did it gain by having the arrow if nobody knows about it? Man, that's like a philosophical question that I'm firmly on one side of. But you, might I think be it on might be like not a philosophical question. I think it might be like a psychological question. Like, mm. is there some sort of subliminal effect that that fucking stupid ass arrow has inside the FedEx logo? Oh, you dick. Uh, it's just I don't know about subliminal, but like, I prefer once again. It's like we were talking about last time with making a reference, right? If you think about, if you think about that arrow inside the logo as a bit of a reference, right? I think that like just leaving it there and not saying a goddamn thing and waiting for people to go, oh, is a super rewarding experience for those who are discovering it. I would argue it's a good feeling. I would argue that the one time you should not deal in subtlety is with like a large, bright corporate logo. I disagree. Uh, I think that I I, because I've been on the other side of that before where like when it comes to like a bit of design for a product. When you realize something about it later on that you didn't notice before, I, I love that feeling. I'm like, oh, that's so cool that they did that. It's nice and you know, nice and subtle, you know. But you Ooh. know, that's just me. Like I said, I thought we had those chance we could be on opposite ends of this. I yeah. had that exact discovery with the Caribou Coffee. So what's up with that logo? First of all, shout outs Caribou Coffee. Good ass coffee. It like it looks like a caribou. What does that mean? And then you look closer. The, lo like, the logo does. The logo well, looks like a caribou. Okay. And then I look closer, and I was like, oh my gosh, everything it's made out of is like a coffee thing. So, its body is a coffee bean, but its body ah. and legs are also like spoons. Ah, I see. Gotcha. What? And then its antlers are also like whipped cream. Is this a new logo? And then its head is like a measuring cup. Can I see this? Yeah. It's... the. It, the old logo just looks like the the like animal, but it, it's what it's really yeah. well done. This is the logo that I know though. Like this is not that new of a logo, right? This no, the, yeah, yeah. Have you seen this? Uh, I it's hard for me to take a look right now. That's fair, but I'll look at it later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It this doesn't be it by the way. It doesn't look as much like a caribou. This guy's gonna end you. Yeah, no, it looks I mean a lot is, less like a caribou you, for sure. Motherfucker. He's got the perfect zoning solution for you. What an asshole. He's handled you. This could be the item. You never know. Oh my know. god, please! It's RoboFruit. I'm sorry. RoboFruit? It's RoboFruit. You know that stuff that they fed RoboCop the only thing he can handle? Give me some RoboFruit, Do you remember what he ate in those movies? Uh, and by those movies, I mean, I think, one movie. RoboCop 1 only? Yeah. Do you remember what he ate? Uh, chili Dog? I don't know. <laughs> it was a rudimentary paste <laughs> that was designed to like keep his very a little paste? organic functions they said? still alive. It was a paste. Yeah. And they said that it looked and tasted like baby food. Okay. Yeah, I can see that going in there. That's so... It's kind of unsettling to me to, to think about, like, oh, this is the only food you need now because, like, you don't have... You don't need it. You don't have many organic pieces left. Kind of horrific, huh? You know, I did Soylent for uh, three, three bottles of Soylent every day and as a replacement for two of my meals for a while. So you were ready to become RoboCop. That's why I did it is because I was like, I hope that like on the event that my family is killed, that I'll be able to like avenge them slowly over time as like a met metaphor for like the military industrial complex. I think you got to rewatch RoboCop because I think you just made up a premise. What? Didn't I? Isn't that what happens in the movie? You think his family gets killed? Oh, he gets like Jesus. All right, then, we gotta. Me and you, we're gonna watch RoboCop. No, what? What? I remember the extremely long death scene of him getting killed, but then like. 
Doesn't it, doesn't it like he ends up going to his own house and then they get mixed up in it? I don't remember. <laughs> we that's what I'm saying. We gotta. It's a dope ass film. You, you know? know what sucks is that I've watched the Joel Kinnaman one like more recently than the the like actual one. Joel Kinnaman. Yeah, he's like a he's like a Nordic actor who he played RoboCop recently, like ten years ago. In what? RoboCop. The movie? Oh, oh, the reboot. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. I'll tell you what. That movie's not great. It's like a hard six and a half, like, in, in terms of, like, a movie that you want to have on and watch the end of. But, like, there's one scene in there where they show what his body really looks like. That's a great scene. That fucking Horrific. Me up. Yeah, Horrific. That, that truly That's what we're, I'm getting at, right? Yeah. Like, these are your only organic bits left, bro. Yeah, that fucks me up. That, also, did you realize that this guy has been orating to us this whole time? La, la, la. I remember this guy. Hello. Hello. So you go to Hogwarts? <laughs> kind of. <laughs> he like literally yes. <laughs> you want to help him? Help him fall off this. <laughs> we do have a kick. Uh, what? Dude, I this mean, part of this man. Does he? Well, wait. I know that he sends you to some castles to like liberate his castle, but what yeah. do we need that to be our Mario? No, our there's Mario nothing, mummy. There's nothing in his fort that we need. But we're gonna go to that. Fort. Our Marunculus. Oh, no. I'm downvote that. You don't like Marunculus? No. Marunculus sounds like uh, like a whimsical, like British, like fake word from a, like a song from the 60s that Dr. Doolittle would sing. I'm having a Marunculus time. Man. With you. When I was little, I went from the Eddie Murphy, Dr. Doolittle to reading the book, and I was like, this is wildly this different. This sucks. This is way different. You were like waiting. But I for liked the, it. You're waiting for the scene in the book where that guinea pig's like, this feels good. I got, I got this. <laughs> that, I remember that scene like to this day. Yeah. And Eddie Murphy's like, ooh, well, let's see this. Let's see this little guy. It's just little guy. It's always good. <laughs> <laughs> and then you, you know, the whiplash you get from going from that, because I watched like one scene from Delirious last night. Oh. The fucking Goonie Goo Goo scene. Oh my God. Why would you bring a Bigfoot in my house, Gus? He sounds like with my children. He sounds like my family. That's the that's that's it. It's like everybody's so funny. got a yeah. fucked up family. Yeah. Go ni go go. That's some Bigfoot talk. I know a Bigfoot when I see one, Gus. <laughs> that's a funny gag. How old is he right there? Eighteen years oh, old. Oh man, he's like twenty. Twenty years. Yeah, old. Yeah, like fuck. That fucks me up. Like Bob Dylan, like playing like a Rolling Stone, like one of the most like recognizable American songs. Motherfuckers like Timothy Chalamet, like a tw- fucking. <laughs> 23 year old like uh, 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 and everybody was like what does he mean we're failures I know we're, we're, we're failures it's true I mean I, I do love Bob Dylan but it just makes me feel like shit that I'm 35 and I haven't even written like a Rolling Stone hey man don't compare yourself to others compare yourself to the you that ordered a whole pizza and ate it by yourself yesterday hey that's All right did I tell you guys the other day I had the drunk drunchies and I ordered 40 chicken nuggets and me, ate all of them. Let me pause you real quick. Uh-huh. Drunchies, is that like you're so drunk that you need to eat food? I'm just hungry from being drunk. Never heard that before, but I got it as soon as you said it. It's people who drink co-opting weed culture. Ooh, here we go. I'm just kidding. I am ready for this Jets versus Kinda. Shark showdown. I mean, there's no... Oh, wait, the the Sharks just didn't show up. They they stayed home playing PlayStation 5. Oh, wait a minute. The sharks the sharks are fighting each other now. Oh, wait. And the, weeping. And fucking each other. Yeah. Oh, right. damn. The Jets are... Uh, Fortnite. War zone. Cirrhosis. Lethargy. Boys. Boys. Only boys. <laughs> oh, are you guys okay? Are you dead? No, I'm just taking a little right. It's just beer. Oh! It's just beer. Wow. It's just beer. Fuck these bugs. Dude. Oh. I got the drenchies. That's me right there. Uh, right after I had the drunchies. <laughs> oh shit! It's going down. What was that? The the wolf NATO? <laughs> yo, oh! yo! It's going the fuck. Down. Oh, this is bears v wolves. Yeah, or bear one bear v wolves. I if this motherfucker doesn't stop fucking, he's gonna like zap you in the head and you're gonna fall down and then this bear is gonna like eat your face. <sighs> I hate Don't it. go too close to the bear. I'm gonna kill that bear. I mean, yeah, but let him get. Look at how many wolves there are. Slouching towards the Bethlehem. Oh shit! They got him. Okay, hold on. Oh, ooh. this is gonna do like no damage. Yeah, that was a big mistake, wasn't it? Get okay. out of here. Get out of here. I'm not, Dude, Alex. You're gonna get one shot. I'm gonna help the wolves. Ah. Okay, let me. Oh no 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 no. All right, let me do this. If these wolves start fucking with me, man, 
Come on, fellas! Just back up. Just just let them all get killed first. This is like a gorilla I'm not, bear. If, I, if all the wolves get killed, then... Oh, look at that, look at that. Fuck you guys. That's what I'm Come saying. On. The wolves are like attrition winners. Oh! Come on, buddy. Come on. If these... Come on, buddy. I'm on your side. I'm you're on like your using, side. You're using like spirit ashes, but like without spirit ashes. That's right real. Now. Fuck. Come on. Come on. Okay. Yep, sippies. Oh! Amazing. That was almost it. Yeah, please keep it. What are they doing? That what? Oh my god. That's it, right? Probably, but it's all good. Oh, uh, oh shit, okay. Somewhere. Wow! I'm just... He was not even facing me. He got you with, like, the wind that he, like, whipped his arm across, and then the tornado, like, a, like when you, like, drop something big in water, and it goes, like, zoop, Amazing, dude. Pulled you into his arms. I was like, this Romantic. is great. He's not facing me. This is gonna be awesome. Nope. In another context, it was kind of sweet. It was pretty cool looking. It's Not literally like, I just died in your arms tonight. <laughs> Actually, uh, he killed me after I was in his arms. Technically, he hit me again with his arm after I was out of his arms. It's like a comment. Uh, angle. That's the JP uh, Kane guy. J Street Fighter JP? A Hadouken would simply ignite the cane on fire. Oh, right. Uh, there's no reason. See, there's a difference, though. There's, like, a difference between the guy that's like, um, actually, it works like this, and the guy that's like, I'm mad in the moment, and, and it should work the way I want it to work, you know? In fighting games, which are a representation of reality. Right. Yeah. Look right. at that. I'm going in. Look at that. He swung his arm through the air as they were falling, and he took out, like, half their life <laughs> of, like, four guys. Ooh, what's the Trina's Lily? I think that's, uh, you can be used to make sleeping items. Fuck, bro, just... Maybe, like, throw the ball from a little farther back? I could do the fireball, but look at that. I know he's Oh, shit, he's going to... All right, look, look, look. So now... Mm. Oh, damn! That's good stuff, huh? That... Just let them do that one more time. You got them. Yeah, you're probably right. I'll try a fireball. Check it out. Yo. And Fuck! The AOE... I hit the dogs! Yo, but the AoE is not bad on that. Yeah. I'm only hitting dogs! Yo, have you watched the movie Hudson on, Hawk on. before? Oh, okay. You're so close. You He's got out. Him. He's out. Oh, who got down? The dog? The bear did. Fuck. The dog down the bear? That's what they've been doing. Yeah. We're good. All right, fellas. You've done well. It's time for Night Night. Have you seen the movie Hudson Hawk? No. Do you know who Richard E. Grant is? No. He is like... One of those, like, kind of uppity British guys who, like, is a character actor, so sometimes he plays, like, a kind of Doctor who -y unhinged guy. Cool. And uh, he plays, like, a kind of crazy villain with, like, a girlfriend that he's, like, you know, those villains that have, like, a sidekick girl that they, like, kiss on the whole time? Sure. Ha 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 ha! Sure. And they're like, do it, baby! Sure. So they're, like, those guys. And then there's a dog in the movie, and we were playing the Game Boy game first because it was with Jesse and Davis on his channel. And, uh... We were like, surely they don't, like, shoot dogs. They, they don't, like, hurt dogs in the movie. And they literally shoot a dog out of a window using a pitching machine in Hudson Hawk. Oh, my God. Like, it's played for laughs. Like, it's, like, very, like, goofy looking, like, bust a Baxter getting kicked off the bridge kind of vibes. Oh, it looks like a doll. Yeah, but it's still, like, you're like, oh! My poor baby. Also, I have no idea why you would cast, like... Like, Bruce Willis makes sense. I think it's his, like, dream movie. I think it's, like, his, like, cool guy movie that he, like, wanted to make. He's, like, a bluesy guy who, like, is a thief who, like, does heists based on songs. But then, I forget who is who the who the guy is in the movie, but it's, like, the least cool guy you could pick to be his backup guy mm. in a fucking thing. I always love when they just, like, throw people out windows or off buildings, and it's just, like, clearly a doll. It was yeah, Dan it's, it's Danny funny. Aiello. It's always good. Oh, huh. Bruce Willis and Danny Aiello as cat burglars. It's like so weird. And they, they do the song, uh, Would you like to swing on a star? No. That's, the, that's the heist music. Hmm. What are they doing? Pride Rock? Like the new king? It seems that way because the, the big one is up here. It's giving like a speech. What if I just took out their... their oh, these game? are like representing the hyenas? That's political violence. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, this is an assassination. So he had his Praetor Guard up here who got taken out first. Yeah, not much. Man. Sat political assassination is like the wildest thing that we're all like, oh yeah, that's a thing that happens on Earth. It's real! Yeah, it's crazy. Like Shinzo Abe? So insane. Do you know about that? 
You heard about this? <laughs> do, you know, do you know about Shinzo Abe? Do you know who that is? <laughs> Tell them about Shinzo Abe, Alex. You heard, you heard this? You heard about this? Tell you about, about this? Uh, uh, Shinzo, Shinzo Abe was the prime minister, or like whatever the, I don't know what the, prime minister of Japan? I will get to that brand deal, I swear, but this is just not the time. He was he was giving no no, a, no 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 segue it. He segue was giving it. a speech and he was murdered at the podium by a guy who made a handmade shotgun out of like tubes because it was Japan, and you can't like mm. you can't like have a gun so you have to make your own. And speaking of making your own in Uh-oh. this world, that's what we're doing at <laughs> superbeardbros.com. I mean patreoncom slash superbeardbros, <laughs> a real website that you can visit where uh, you give us money in exchange for us continuing to make this fine show. And if you go there and you do that, not only do you get everything we've ever made for all patrons at all levels, there's only one tier, it's ten dollars, and it gets you our entire channel thirty days ahead. So go over there, check it out, and there will never be an ad on a Patreon video. So go check that out. Have a great time. I love you. Kisses. Back to the game. This is pretty fucking important. America. This has nothing to do with Mario, but this is a critical ass item. America. Nice. You know what I'm saying? Like, just close to Mario. Like, I got you. Know. you. I got you. Oh, the tiers are like the augments, right? That you can like tune. They're like, uh. You can have like two equipped at once. Or they're passives. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's actually really good. Okay. What is I'll that? Take that. That like buffs the potency of our, of our flasks. Oh. So let's do all that right now. Yeah, let's get, let's get strong. Let's get tough. And then I definitely want to go and... Let's get one. I knew that was coming. Let's get I was like, one. oh man, I want to avoid it. But it happened. The funny thing is, we recorded Couldn't that episode... Resist. We recorded that episode, I would say, five months ago? Maybe something like four months ago? Still won't be out. Still won't be out <laughs> by the time you see this. <laughs> yeah, it's true. And then it's going to pay off for you, and you're going to be like, oh. <laughs> and that's... Yeah, it won't yeah. be, oh, that be a big thing. That was good, guys. All uh, right. What do we get? Restores half of total HP. I'll take that. Temporarily boost strength. Yeah. Fucking. Oh, we've had that. That's we've been we, holding. We it. we yeah. we uh, we picked that up earlier. Okay, great. <clears throat> so that'll be nice eventually. But wondrous physic. We just got the ability to use these, right? Mm-hmm. Matter of fact, I'm going Did to you see that boy. No, I didn't see anything. There's a giant on the other side of this wall. Did you? I think kill? we already killed him okay. ages ago. I'm gonna put our physic right. I'm Years totally ago. down. Nice. To try to put me. Ah, uh, in the this is live. Yeah, yeah, we killed this guy. That's uh, like the most like like truly anxious audio that I've ever heard of somebody's when he says this is live. Oh, this is live. Because it's like truly your internal thoughts coming out of your mouth. I think there's like a five percent chance. I think there's I think five percent of his emotions when he said that were him. Asking like, please tell me this isn't live. Like, please tell he's me like, there's a chance that he's we... like. And if I recall correctly, this is live. Right. Like, please, yeah. please tell me this isn't. Live. Yeah. Oh, remember these? Ooh, no, not at all. Oh, what I know where this. What in is. hell is this? This summons a ghost zombie. Zombie ghost. Is he nice? Yeah, he like leads us somewhere. Oh, like to a cave or something. Yeah. Is that a bear? It's definitely a bear. That's a regular. Oh, what? we're just. This is just Bear Town over here. It really is. This place sucks. <laughs> Kinda, yeah. This is not where we want to be. Would you say it's unbearable? Fuck me. <sighs> he didn't have to. Oh, oh shit. he's just a regular. But he's a regular. He bear. tanked it. He was like, "What's up, stupid?" He's just a regular bear. He's all right. I'm not. I don't want to. I don't want to catch that bear. Are we close to? Oh, we're like right on top of it. Great. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Holy shit. Let's go grab Is this where he's taking us? No. I think he's taking us somewhere else. Gold tinged excrement? Thank you, ghost. <laughs> That's for you. Somebody was eating at the Salt Bay restaurant and had the like four, 24 karat gold pizza. Just like shit it out in the fucking forest because it gave him diarrhea. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. There's something right there, too. Okay. Next so time we go in this forest. Acre wood? Mm-hmm. Right here yep. in this forest? Like maybe right around here? Mm hmm. We're getting another Mario item. Oh, yes. It's a pretty important one. It is the the butt stomp. Oh, shit. That's going to be a game changer. Yeah, eventually. So the Once hunt we have begins? It tuned, the hunt begins, baby. Uh, We're in there. But where's where's our boy? Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah. He's right here. God, <clears throat> what are you taking us towards? Like the worst stuff in the woods, man. <laughs> Come on. It's just a little bit further. He's right by the Bat Boys. He, he broke left. Yo, there's another big bear over there. Your boy broke left. Did he? Yeah. Thanks. 
Where are you going, little skelly boy? Do these guys, do they see me? I think that white maned one might see you. Are they both white maned? I can't tell. That's Owl. That's Owl? That's Eeyore. That's Eeyore. <laughs> when you don't poo, zombie goes to <laughs> taking steps toward an imminent danger. How shitty would it be if this <laughs> zombie just took you to like an empty like jar that said honey on it? <laughs> and then he's like, <laughs> just shrugs his shoulders. He's got like two acorns in there. Rabbit femurs in there. <laughs> Expensive poop. Oh, shit. Oh, thanks, buddy. Also, remember this guy? You see uh, guy? Oh, is that the wolf man? Yeah. The wolf boyfriend? <laughs> is that the wolf man? Is that Zed Tigger? <laughs> <laughs> He's a wolf man up there. He kind of he kind of is like Tigger in a way. He jumps. Uh, also, he's an animal. T i double er. <laughs> Should we fuck this bear up? No. The ghost led us here. Is there a bear in here? Yes. Is there any way to get what we want without <clears throat> yes. disturbing him? Yes. Like maybe we should just get it in hand before we fight him. You know? Oh oh oh. Well, it's over now. No no wolves for us this time. I actually didn't do that. You think this one's weaker than the other one? No. He seems like he might be. Fuck. This is so okay. This is just a bad environment for this. Yeah. That's all. Oh. Dude, okay, that's fine. Dude, and he can destroy so much more of it than I thought. Okay. Let's heal that. I do. Oh, oh he doesn't know. He knows about 3D. <laughs> Shoutouts to Tekken coming out today. I'm gonna play his fucking this bear. Tekken 8 is out. Today, yeah. At some like later today. It's like full release. Yeah. We made it. <laughs> yeah, right? What, what, was the, what was the gag? Like, what's up with that Tekken 8? It was like some guy, like, like midway through, like, season two of Tekken 7 was like, you guys got any word on Tekken 8? And we were like, what? <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Guess what? This is it. We're here. Shout outs to that guy. I don't know who it was, but... I think I remember who That really was. broke me as a human being. That wasn't so bad, huh? No. No. I catch flame is not a joke, brother. I still feel like that bear was, like, more scurrilous. Ooh, wait a minute. Okay, wait. Are we in the wrong hole? No, but I just want to see what that... Uh, oh. Charge attacks? Oh, okay. Maybe later, yeah. It's not so bad. Let's go... I'm going to see if we can go get that item, though. I think I know where it is. Also, I, I think there's a secret here. Another secret? I think I'm wrong. Never mind. But yeah, homeboy's up there, and I think I remember how to get him down, but was, we need something. Was there something inside that tower? Which tower? This? Yeah. I, think I, I don't even chest. think it's a tower. It's just... Oh, man. You're killing the game, aren't you? They call me Snake Eyes. Based on the movie, Snake Eyes. Oh, lovely. They call me wow. e Eagle Eyes. Based on the movie, Eagle Eyes. Really useful. Eagle Eye? Dude, good call. Eagle Eye with Shia LaBeouf. There's a weird... There was like a weird crossover where Michelle Monaghan and Shia LaBeouf could be like a couple in a movie. Is that crazy? I know some of those names. Oh, is this it? This? Booyah. Yes! Booyah, baby. Oh, bop, 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 bop. Da Pecco. <laughs> so, we can apply this. We just don't have anything to really apply it to yet. <sighs> That's like the name. It's hard, man. Like, you have to hold it? You have to apply it to a weapon. So, we could do it. Can like, you apply it to the, the torch? nothing right now. We could do it to the torch. Because I feel like the kick is less useful than the torch. Once you apply it, is there, like, no going back? No, you can, no, you, yeah, yeah, you can, can take it off. Can, oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. But the torch right has kick on it right now? The torch has the torch attack. What has kick right now, I think, is us having nothing in hand. Oh, that's just, like, what our body is? Spiked and green spill. Let's two tears? Is. Yeah, they usually give you two per. Uh, you know what? We'll check on it next time we're out of grace so we can, like, actually change it. I vibe that. I also love these sunflowers. Very cool. What's up, dude? Oh, you know what? Let me do this. I wish you could hold one and wield it as a weapon and attune butt slams to it. What? Did, what did he give you? Teardrops? Yeah, because we're at an Erd tree. These Erd trees. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Let's continue south. Let's go. You want to go fuck up that... Uh... Slanted Sammy's Haunted Shack? <laughs> Let's hit it. Yeah, maybe we'll just go do that since we're here. Do you remember Slanted Sammy's Haunted Shack? No, nah, man. I literally thought you just made that up. Slanted Sammy's Haunted Shack? Hell no. Dude, if you keep saying it, he's going to show up. I, this is for my SoCal friends. Slanted Sammy's Haunted Shack. You gotta just... 
was uh, one of those uh, like roadside attractions, like like the mm. mystery spot, mm. but it was at Knott's Berry Farm. Oh, interesting. And you could like go, st- you know, do all the bits like, oh, whoa, I'm standing on one side of the house and I'm like way taller than my dad. Oh, I remember ones like that. Yeah. yeah. Or like, oh. They usually showed up at like carnivals. Yeah. Or like or like a tourist trap in the middle of the woods in Santa Cruz, California or something. You know what I, mean? I will take your word on it for that one. Like, you know, biggest ball of yarn in the world type vibes. Oh, shit, I'm out. Ow. Oh, where, where the fuck you were you from? at? Giant motherfucker! Come, uncover your eyes. Have some self-respect. I'm not going down to these guys, Alex. I fucking refuse. They're beneath me. I agree. They're beneath us. I agree. We are real human beings. It's the type of racism that makes sense. <laughs> Almost not even racism. It's just the way things are. It's just hard-coded, visual difference-based hatred. Right. They're clearly different, <laughs> and that difference Isn't makes that a them guy? inferior. This is one of them. Like he's like, I'll give you my prayers. If you... Really? He refused to talk to me on horseback? Hi, Mario! Oh, God, I would hate that. I don't know, I don't know if it was like a D&D reference, but I saw a video of a, a dude that was like, Oh, hey, guys! And it was just a bunch, like a wizard and a dwarf and an elf. And they're like, Hey, this is a dwarf. He loves money. And, and he's like, That's a little racist. Mm. <laughs> what? No, 100%. he loves money. But it's true. It's true, right? It's true. The one that's like the weird one is like the goblins in Harry Potter that like run the banks and have big noses. Yeah, we don't like to talk about them, do we? Oh, yeah, and sometimes they just get killed and they're like kind of, they don't care. Yeah, the the house elves are like, ah, who the fuck cares? (laughs) Temporarily boosts stamina. Oh, Dobby died? Fuck Dobby. (laughs) I guess we can use this one for now. We're not really using strength yet, but we will soon. Stams? But yeah, temporarily boosts stamina and restores half of HP. Let's do this for now. What's the white one? That's charged attack, boost oh. charge attack, but well, we're not using that right now. But we might very soon in the future. We find a hammer. Also, is it time to level up? Yeah, we can do one. I've been do. I did uh, last time I leveled up. I did two in vigor. Um, I just think it's smart. That being said, it's probably also time to start doing this. I'm thinking about the future, brother. I'm look. I'm with you. I have no idea what items are coming, so I just sure. have to kind of trust that you are true. making the right calls here. Like, That's I know we're going to be fireballs. I know we're going to maybe get a hammer at some point. we got a butt slam now. What does that use? MP? Yeah, it does. Yeah. I think I'm going to do this, man. That's the. This is me letting you guys at home know. It's time. We're, 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 we're going to have some more armaments, hopefully, somewhat soon. The king has returned. Look at him. Oh, my God. Really, really he looks really. so mad at the world. He looks like a Slav guy. Yeah. He looks like his name yeah. is, like, Dimitri. I can't get... Freddie Mercury out of my head. It's just all I see. <laughs> if if he made it to like 2024, that's him. True. Yeah. Thank you guys for hanging with us. We'll see you soon. Love you guys. Good love you. Bye. <laughs>